Hey everyone, struggling to pick the perfect productivity tool? Today we're comparing Tana, Obsidian, and Notion in a quick showdown to find which one suits your needs best. Let's dive in. First up, we have Tana. It's a cloud-based outliner with powerful databasing like Notion and Roam Research had a baby. Tana's AI native workspace excels at organizing thoughts, automating meeting notes, and building a second brain for deep knowledge management. It's intuitive but lacks some advanced features like financial systems. Next, we have Obsidian. This free markdown-based note-taking app stores data offline, perfect for privacy-conscious users. Its knowledge graph visualizes connections between notes, making it ideal for research and and personal knowledge management. Seeking and collaboration require paid add-ons though. Finally, we have Notion, the all-in-one workspace for note-taking, project management, and team collaboration. Notion's customizable databases, templates, and real-time editing shine for teams and visual organizers. Its cloud-based but offline access is limited and setup can feel complex. Tana is best for solo users building a knowledge hub with its outlining and AI tools. Obsidian rules for offline, private note-taking, and research with its graph view. Notion dominates for teams needing collaboration and versatile project management. For ease of use, Notion's interface is beginner-friendly, while Obsidian has a markdown learning curve. And Tana's unique workflow takes some getting used to. The winner? It depends on you. Solo researchers go Obsidian. Team players pick Notion. Knowledge builders try Tana. Which one's your vibe? Drop it in the comments. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more productivity tips.